If you watched my recent video on soda, you know how terrible it is for you. But it's hard to quit, and I would know. I was a Diet Coke addict. I drank eight a day. So today, I want to show you what soda is actually doing to your insides. Now, I learned this as a young kid growing up in Omaha. My next door neighbor was a professor of chemistry at the University of Nebraska, Omaha. And he would take us over to his house and he'd put a tooth in a glass of soda. And right before our eyes, we watched that tooth dissolve. Now, I know you don't have a lot of teeth laying around to play with, but I want to show you a simple science experiment. And all you need is a glass of soda and some milk. So, like I showed you in the last video, what you want to do with soda is pour it down the drain. But we're just going to pour a little bit out. And now I'm going to take some milk, any milk you have around. I'm going to pour it in the soda. And you got to do this slowly, because if you do it too quick, it'll foam right up like a bottle of champagne. So just fill that up, OK, and put the cap back on. Now, just let it sit. In an hour, it'll start to look like this. And wait a little bit longer, and all of a sudden, there's a big clear space. And down in the bottom, you'll see all this stuff. In fact, it looks pretty disgusting. So what does this disgusting reaction tell us? The phosphorus, an acid in the cola, severely reacted with the calcium in the milk, and it formed this precipitate. Now just imagine this reaction is happening inside of you. It's no wonder there's a link between soda and osteoporosis. In fact, research has shown in women who are soda drinkers, they have far less bone density. And I know, because believe it or not, as a former soda drinker, I had less bone density, which is now restored since I threw away my colas. It's also destroying your teeth, just like the professor of chemistry showed me years ago. So the next time you want a soda, ladies and gentlemen, picture this. I'm always looking out for you.